Hi, my name is Priscilla, and today I'm going to show you how to extract DNA from split peas. Here's what you need to get started. Rubbing alcohol, salt, meat tenderizer, clear soap, has to be clear, toothpicks, a couple of mixing spoons, you need glasses, one cup of warm water, a strainer, some measuring cups, blender, split peas, and some black construction paper. Let's get started. First, we're going to start by taking a quarter of a spoonful of salt and adding it to our warm water mixture. Mix it thoroughly until all the salt is dissolved. Now, let's add your warm water and salt to our blender as well as half a cup of split peas. Place the lid back on and start at a very low speed. Slowly start to increase your speed for a better mix. This should take you about 30 seconds to a minute. Make sure to blend really well so that you have a pea-like soup substance. Take your lid off. Now pour through a strainer, separating the liquid from the solids. You'll need to use your spoon to help the liquid go through. This should take you a couple minutes. When you're done, you will have extracted all the liquid and are left with this solid paste. Next, we're going to add two spoonfuls of clear hand soap. Mix thoroughly. The soap destroys the phospholipids in the plasma membranes. This will open up the cells and allow their contents into the liquid. You want to mix this thoroughly and allow it to sit for 10 minutes. Notice that the liquid content has changed colors. It is now a darker green. Next, we're going to take our meat tenderizer and add a quarter of a spoonful to our pea mixture. The meat tenderizer has an enzyme that destroys the protein coat of DNA that exposes the strands. Lastly, we're going to add an equal amount of rubbing alcohol. Add this in slowly, because you'll want your alcohol to stay on the top of the cup. Depending on how you do your experiment, you may be able to see the strands even before you remove them from the cup. Once you're done, take your toothpick and start to remove the strands from the cup. 
place them on the black sheet of paper so that you can see the DNA that you have extracted. Okay. That's how you extract DNA from split piece. Thanks for watching.